We set up an experiment to find out if sticky substances like spider tag give pitchers an unfair advantage. That was legit. You can hear the difference out of the hand. The MLB thinks so and has cracked down on it throughout the 2021 season. This is part of the new daily life in Major League Baseball. Go for his sticky check. But were they right? Let's find out. Pitchers have always found a way to maintain a grip on a baseball, whether it be spit or rosin. But most recently, a product called Spider Tack has been introduced, which is like sticky stuff on steroids. Before we start, let's break down the physics behind why pitchers want a better grip on the ball. When a pitcher throws a baseball, it spins as it flies through the air. The number of rotations the ball completes is called the spin rate, which we usually measure in RPM. How a ball interacts with the air is complex. For example, if a pitcher adds top spin, like in a curveball, the airflow around the ball will cause up to a foot of vertical break before it reaches the catcher. The spin rate, spin direction, and speed of the ball all impact its trajectory. This is called the Magnus effect. If the spider tack allows the pitcher to get a better grip on the baseball, I would expect to see an increase in spin rate. I wouldn't expect to see any change in the velocity. Lucky for us, Brockport Baseball already has technology to track that. So we use this technology called the Rapsodo for our pitchers and the development of our pitchers. Within seconds after a pitch is thrown, it gives us data points on a pitcher's spin rate, horizontal and vertical break, and velocity. The experiment will test pitches thrown with and without spider tack. Meet our pitcher who is throwing 10 fastballs and 10 curveballs without any substance, averaging a spin rate around 2100 for both types of pitches. Next, we added the spider tag. According to the Rapsoda data, he increased his RPMs enough to be in line with the average MLB pitcher. After 40 pitches, our results show that on average with spider tack, the pitcher increased the spin rate by about 10% with no change to velocity. It's pretty clear that the spider tack provides an advantage by adding a lot of friction between the pitcher's hand and the baseball. If you're interested in learning more about physics, or if you're interested in increasing your spin rate legally, take a look at SUNY Brockport.